Hey, what's going on guys? I just wanted to make a quick video because I saw a Humble Bundle that is, I think, really useful for just about everyone watching this who is not an advanced Linux administrator. There is a Linux and open source Humble Book Bundle right now. This one is totally worth getting. I bought this one myself. It is an A-Press uh, bundle with a ton of their pro and beginning books, like those two series. For 15 bucks, you get them all. And um, there's some awesome topics in here. I'll just go through them and why they're insanely useful uh, very quickly right now. Uh, pro Git, obviously you, you need to know Git if you're working in tech these days. If you are ever gonna write a script that's more than 50 or 100 lines, you need to know Git. If you're ever gonna work with developers, you're gonna need to know Git. You're gonna need to know Git. So you should probably have this book as you all know, I recently did an Ansible course. I did a whirlwind tour where you can check out the basics of Ansible to see if it's interesting to you. It's an automation tool that is very powerful. It has some annoying problems right now. It's still you know, fairly young, but it's becoming much more usable and it's extremely powerful already. So if you don't know Ansible, that's another one of those things that's like both useful and excellent to have on your resume. Pro Vim. It really is a steal for this bundle. Like, you will get more than $15 of value out of just reading Pro Vim and becoming sort of proficient with Vim. Vim or VI will be installed on just about every system you ever log into as a sysadmin, whether it's on a Unix operating system or a Linux distro, no matter where you are, and regardless of what kind of like software development environment and editor you have locally on your dev machine. It's a required skill. I like the LPIC materials. I think it's an excellent vendor neutral Linux curriculum, uh, and I highly recommend it for self study. Whether or not you end up getting the cert, they cover material that is not just hyper specific to one distro. I've met a lot of people that get really confused when they go from one distro, like from a Red Hat to a Debian based distro, because they thought that that was the only way that it's done in Linux. So I, I think a lot of the vendor specific certifications can trick you into thinking that the way that this vendor does it, is Linux. And looking at the LPIC materials, you'll see sort of where that line is between the Linux operating system, the user land stuff, where the distro modifications come in. I think it's an excellent place to start. Nginx, I think this is another, like, I just freaking love this bundle. Okay, so Nginx is just one of the greatest tech tools there is. Uh, I'm going to jump in and show you the table of contents here. You can kind of see what you get here. Hosting static sites, hosting dynamic sites, so like your PHP sites or you know other language runtime like backends, which gets you into kind of proxying, which gets you to load balancing, automation, SSL and security, on and on. It's like this is a course in Nginx. If you had to choose today between learning Apache really well and Nginx really well, just looking forward to the future, I would say learn Nginx. It is an incredible tool you will find a million places to use it throughout your career. And knowing it well and knowing what it can do well and where it's kind of awkward to use will make you much more powerful. Pro Docker. Uh, Docker is one of those technologies. You love it, you hate it. It's FreeBSD jails, it's Solaris zones, but 20 years too late. And suddenly it is the, the most hyped thing in the entire world. Everyone pretends that Docker invented everything. They still haven't gotten fundamental things right. It's buggy, it's unstable, but God damn it, it's used everywhere. Having it on your resume, I mean, just spending a week learning Docker is probably one of the finest investments you can make in your financial future and your resume. Just go through this book, learn basic Docker skills, set up some projects. Please don't believe that Docker is the answer to everything. It just makes like getting any kind of DevOps job so much easier if you understand containers can reason about them can talk about them know some of the networking and how that stuff works under the under the covers so Jesus, 15 bucks you know what i mean it's like you can add 15 grand to your salary a year from one month to the next by like knowing this and getting a job that requires it invest in yourself okay finally practical linux topics i think this is a super interesting book i kind of didn't know what to expect when i first uh, took a look at it but I'll show you the table of contents. This is actually giving me ideas for videos I kind of want to make. It's kind of like things that are important and interesting, but that don't make it into a lot of tutorials or Linux basics books. Um, but they're just like tools that you really want to know. Like 
wget, high availability, working with system D, actually making sure the data is destroyed and not just RMing a file and hoping for the best, looking at your network. Like, you see what I'm saying? It's kind of like looking at interesting things that are occasionally dark corners in terms of documentation or other people covering this in like ye old Linux 101 book. I actually, I, I think that this is the one I'm going to get the most out of just in terms of like interesting little video ideas out of all of these books. But I think if you are an admin just starting out, you just can't go wrong with this bundle. So have a look. And if you see it in your heart to use the partner link that I've got in the description, I would appreciate that very much. Um, I think that gives you a slider where when you buy, yeah, when you buy, it sends you down here, choose where your money goes, and then you can select me. But don't give me all the money. You know, the charities are amazing. I highly recommend the EFF. So if you split it between me and the developers or the writers and the EFF, I'll be a happy man. Thanks again, guys. I really appreciate it. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.